<laughs> the fact that he turned around right before he died is. Lies of P. This is a game that I, I don't know anything about this game other than it's a new Soulsborne, Souls-like game uh, that was just shown at the Summer Games Fest. The demo is out on Steam now, and I was like, well, let's let's just let's send it, let's play it. Pinocchio-based. Yeah, apparently the P is Pinocchio, Lies of Pinocchio. In honor of the great writer Carlo Collodi. Can you hear me? I can. Geppetto's puppet. In Geppetto. We need your help. Wait, what? Wait, what the hell? Lies of Pinocchio. Wait, am I Pinocchio? Oh, checking for Estes. Hold on. Okay. Ah, there you are. I've been looking all over for you. Okay. So left trigger is left arm of steel. Arms of steel. Environment looks cool. Okay, this game is too hard. What am I supposed to do? Can you walk faster? You actually can't. I see they got Jiminy too. But we have to hurry. Wait, what? My name is Sophia. Please come to Hotel Crot and I'll explain what's happening. Jiminy, please escort him to the hotel. It's like Gemini. Oh. Let's get you out of there. Find something that might help arm yourself with one of the weapons over there. It'll be helpful on your way to the hotel. Path of the Cricket Balance, Path of the Bastard Dexterity, Path of the Sweeper Strength. Strength. Big old two-hander. Destination Hotel Quads. Recommend escaping from this location. <laughs> One. True. Thanks for the hundred bits, dude. Dude, this looks like the train station in Final Fantasy VII. Oh wait, that's bad guy. Oh, so the left. Okay, man. Oh, so it, dude, it feels just like Dark Souls. Oh wait. Is there? Is that okay? Is this wall? Okay. Okay, I, I was trying to parry. Okay, you hold circle, you sprint. Okay, it, it really is just like Dark Souls, like the controls. A pulse cell will recover HP. Okay, there's your Estus. Wait, I'm sharpening my sword? Oh, frick. Uh, I don't see a parry. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. The left arm of steel, whenever I use it, its health goes down. You see how that left arm of steel has a, uh... Has a health bar, so maybe it's maybe it's not parry. Maybe it's like a a really powerful like stagger type thing. See how it goes down. Okay, and then there's that white bar behind me. You can sharpen the sword. Okay, this is the bigger enemy. Okay, I'm getting railed. Okay, so I have that. I have one of those blue bars. I want to save. I want to save the blue bar for the next one. Oh, finally, frick! Dude, I'm actually gonna die. I'm actually gonna die while I, I, I'm I'm here like trying to freaking. Okay. It's not a boss. No, it's just a big enemy. Yo, I was wrong button. Ah! Frick! I thought I was gonna do enough damage to kill him. That's why. I, that's why I full committed, dude.
I'm actually getting railed by this guy. Now, part of me is like, I, I'm, I'm trying to like learn some stuff, but he's actually railing me. Nice! Sick! Okay, so fatal attack is when they get staggered. He was like doing this, and you walk up in front of him in R1. It's literally the exact same as Dark Souls. Okay, when I say somebody's getting railed, is that the way other people use that phrase? Because that's not the way that I use that phrase. I was thinking like, like you're getting hit with like a rail gun. That's what I've always thought of it like. No, it is a sex thing. What if you're a virgin? Then is it a rail gun? It's like getting effed in the A. Wait, is getting effed in the A like a sex thing? Because that is not how I use it either. Because when I say getting effed, I'm saying it's not, it's not. No, it's found. I think the phrase you're looking for is getting a train run on you. It's like getting hit by a train. Yeah, exactly. Well, like I use getting effed in the A like, that's not a, that, whenever I say getting effed in the A, I, I mean like getting freaky in the attic. Like, it's not like a sex thing. It's just easier to say because less syllables. You know? Like dancing? No, like it's scary. Like it's like creaky and it's like, you know, dark and dusty in there. Gather ergo, clever one. Yeah, the go. stargazer will make you stronger. But the stargazer's strength oh, doesn't last oh, forever. So be careful with it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Stop doing that. Oh, oh. SpongeBob. Okay. Okay, let's level up. We got 2,900 XP. We got 2,900 souls. Vitality is health. Vigor is stamina. Capacity. Uh, legion weight. It's like your stagger. Motivity. Technique. Obviously, you put all your points in strength. The Falcons were the joke of the NFL. Until How one day. Alone? You could use some help. Howdy fellas, I'm a new coach. Now this hillbilly has to turn this group of chumps into champs. Play a movie trailer. Told you that ain't enough. Coach Espend, only in theaters this summer. <laughs> that's, Rated actually, R. that's actually so good. Oh, I missed the shortcut? Oh no. This is the boss. Okay, first boss, the parade, the parade master. Okay. Oh, frick, man. Dude, I love how he looks. Oh my gosh. I didn't have my heal equipped. I was trying to, I was trying to use my heal. Here. Prepare the weapon. Look at his face. He's nice. He's smiling. Is that a mustache? Okay, good. Oh, 
He's on fire? Oh god. What is that text? Okay. I'm about to get railed. <laughs> the fact that he turned around right where he died is... <laughs> That's actually so funny. Nice. Oh my gosh, please, no. Just one more hit, dude. Nice! There it is. Where's the health bar? It's on the bottom. My health bar is on the top. <clears throat> Those other attempts were so close, man. Do I say I'm a puppet or a human? Uh. Oh wait, what did she tell me to say? I can't remember. I'm gonna tell him I'm a puppet. Yes, the illusion of choice. Did I not pick human just now? Like, not just now, but right before it? And it said puppets are sort of trouble? Lies of P. Is this it? Is that the demo? Well, isn't the demo just a tutorial? Wait, what? You're not even halfway with the demo? Wait, how do you guys know? The demo just came out. We found out about the demo at the same time. Oh, wait, but I, I wasn't playing it right away. I was doing the Devolver. I'm so happy to see you. Ah, yes, the Firekeeper's Shrine. I am Sophia. I've been waiting for you. Searched all over the city of Krat to find you. You must have questions. Geppetto will have answers. But we have to find him first. Geppetto. He was last seen on Elysian Boulevard. Elysium. All of Krat. Wait, Elysian Boulevard? Humans. And that neighborhood is one of the scariest. Wait, isn't the area where you come in Elden Ring Please called like Elysian Fields or something? Elysian Boulevard. <clears throat> Unexpected guests are welcome. It's we so funny, like the similarities are like dark. Like, there's uh, so many parallels to like all the Dark Souls games. But, I mean, again, that, that's what they're doing. Job. They're doing that on purpose. That's what people want. Welcome. The armor is purely cosmetic. You guys like the armor just being cosmetic? I don't like that. I, I like having like stats and like building up gear. Why? So, so the reason why is that. I mean, maybe it's just me being like old school RPG player. I like being able to like pick out gear and stuff that's going to like cater to the playstyle of my character. Like, yeah, crafting a build is half the fun. I've always said that like the, the most fun part about playing most any game is like building. And I don't mean like literally like building a house or something like in Minecraft, but I mean building out your character. Building essentially is in a, in a very, very broad sense, like building out a character, building out their what stats, building out a story battle, even right? like from like an RPG standpoint. Oh, you can, you can teleport between bonfires. You can switch your legion arms here. Legion arm that can release a wire can be strung around 
An enemy to drag them toward you or move you to them. Ooh, okay. Wire instantly narrows this between one on one's enemy, but it cannot guarantee one's safety afterward. So this one is just like a big damage, like a big crank. Just boom. But this one, on the other hand, is like half the damage. Yeah, this is like literally like half the damage, but it's like a get over here, or I'm coming over there. Okay. Okay, that's sick, dude. Dude, that's actually sick, man. That is fun. Frick! I got stuck on the dock. Or the, not the dock, the, what is that? The shin, shin, sh um, uh, fence. Frick! Nice. Yeah, I would say overall, I mean, I've done a boss of this game. I, I think overall, I mean, when we're talking about like Soulsborne, Souls-like, whatever, uh, if we're talking about those kinds of games, I think that these games are uh, they're very popular, right? obviously because of how popular Dark Souls is, Elden Ring, all that stuff, Bloodborne. You have a lot of these other uh, studios trying to make games that are very similar, that similar mechanics, similar feel. Parallels between this and a Dark, Soul, Dark Souls game is like actually kind of hilarious. Like you basically have the Firekeeper and you know, you, you go in, this is the Firekeeper Shrine, and you have the NPCs, and you go upgrade your weapons. You know, it's like a knockoff or whatever, right? Some people might say that, but this is what people want. Whenever it comes to Soulsborne games, Souls-like games, whatever, people want a very specific thing. They want it to feel a certain way. They want the buttons they press to do the things that they do in the other game that they play. I feel like this game does that so far. I obviously, I have some problems in the demo, or there's some problems I have with the demo. I don't like the durability system where you're constantly having to repair your weapon. It's kind of annoying. Uh, I don't really think it adds anything to the game as far as like any real value or depth to the game uh, that I can think of. I feel like you should just get rid of it outright. But everything else seems cool. I like I like the arms. Like Legion arms, as they call them. Yeah, I like the Legion arms. I think that's cool. And then also like basing the story off of like Pinocchio is, is like a very, you know, it's a story that everybody grew up. The story of Pinocchio and Geppetto and Jiminy Cricket and all this stuff. I think it's pretty cool. So uh, yeah, I don't like that there's no stats on the armor. Like it's just all cosmetic. I wish there was like actual armor pieces. That'd be kind of cool. This very well could be a game that I play whenever it comes out. So cool. Pog. Great. Awesome. That's Lies of Pete.